an overall tone for the shadow, an overall tone for the light. Shadow, light. Mm -hmm. Shadow, light. And thinking about, you know, placing this tree, you know, classical, you know, one-third kind of thing. Mm -hmm. There's no reason why you, they say you can't put a tree in the middle, but you can and if you put other things around it to get it to work. Balance. So all these rules and what I instructors say, kind of take them with a grain of salt. Mm -hmm. Because they can all be broken. Do you try to match the color? This takes you 200 years. <laughs> <laughs> in 2000 ping. Do you go off in what you want for the color, or do you try to get the color close to what's there? Well, there's three stages of painting. and. A beginner paints what they know. They know the sky is blue, the grass is green, obviously the grass has got to be blue in the sunlight. And they think all shadows are cool and all light is warm. The beginner doesn't know. So that's what they paint. And then you find say, okay, start you then you paint what you see. Then you see the sky is a greenish blue more of a reddish or the grass is a yellow green or <coughs> then they start